The real estate sector is one of the biggest industries in the world, with even a possibility for growth. Over the years, many people have turned to real estate as a way to make some money or even spread their wealth. And while the subject is more prominent these days, it's a sector that has been explored even many years back in the past. If you live in America and you own or have rented an apartment, chances are that your house or apartment is controlled by one man named Sam Zell. While he might not be your typical popular businessman, Sam Zell owns several real estate investments in the United States, and the billionaire always looked destined to be as big as he currently is. In today's video, we'll be taking a look at the life of Sam Zell, as well as his investments that make him the owner of most of America's real estate. Do stay tuned and enjoy! Born in Shmuel, Sri Lanka, Sam Zell was born in Chicago, the United States, to Rushla and Beric Zilanka, who were Jewish immigrants from Poland. Following the potential of a Nazi attack back in the years before his birth, Sam's parents fled the country and settled in Chicago, where his father would become a successful jewelry wholesaler. From a very young age, Sam always had his mind set on business, and just when he was 12, he started his first business-like venture, buying several copies of Playboy magazine and then reselling them for double the price. From that, he would take his first lesson on demand and supply, with this also helping the billionaire when he would get into the University of Michigan. It was at this time that Sam first made moves in the real estate sector, managing a 15-unit apartment building along with his fraternity brother, Robert Lurie. He and Lurie would eventually win a contract with a large apartment developer owner in Ann Arbor, and by the time he graduated from the University of Michigan Law School, they were managing over 4,000 apartments while also owning between 100 to 200 units outrightly. Sam was already netting at least $150,000 at this point. And after his graduation, he sold off his share of the property management business to Lurie before moving back to Chicago. After that, Sam joined a firm of attorneys, only to quit during the same week. This then prompted him to take on an entire career out of investing in real estate. In 1968, Sam Zell founded Equity Group Investments and also got Lurie to work with him again. This time though, they managed to leverage a market crash in 1973 to acquire high quality properties at low prices. At the end of the crisis, Zell and Lurie were already owners of a valuable portfolio of apartments, offices, and retail buildings. They held on to this for many years, and as time went on, the worth of these properties continued to soar and exceed their previous valuation levels, then renting out these properties to make a monthly income. This approach to real estate investing was not popular at the time, and this is one of the reasons why Zell is regarded as the forefather of modern real estate investment trusts. One of his major successes was the sale of 573 office properties to the Blackstone Group for $39 billion in what became the largest leveraged buyout deal in history. The deal eventually turned out to be a pretty clever move as it happened just before a mortgage crisis and real estate slump that happened after 2007. Despite being known to diversify his earnings and purchase several companies, Equity Group Investments remain his main source of wealth. The company is branched into different groups, which are Equity Residential, Equity Office Property Trust, and Equity Lifestyle Properties. Equity Residential is currently one of the largest apartment owners in the United States, with investments in up to 310 properties consisting of 80,407 apartment units in several areas, including Southern California, San Francisco, Boston, Seattle, Denver, Atlanta, Austin, New York, Washington, D.C., and Dallas. Like Equity Residential, Equity Office Property Trust is another large subgroup company that owns 80 office properties comprising 40 million square feet. The last of the groups, Equity Lifestyle Properties, is among the most valuable of the three, and it controls manufactured home and resort communities in the United States. With all these properties all in his control, Sam Snell also has quite the fortune in terms of net worth, with Forbes reporting that the American businessman has a net worth of around $5.2 billion. Aside from his real estate exploits, the billionaire is also known to be a philanthropist, donating heavily to education, arts, and some Jewish causes. What impresses you the most about Zell's early interest in business? Let us know in the comments section. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button, share it with your friends, and of course, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. If you like this video, you should also check out This Family Hiddenly Rules the World.